The impact of thyroid hormones throughout the body. Hi, Dr. Charles Soparker. Welcome back to Pacer Productions video series on thyroid eye disease, a 17 video series in 10 sections. This is the second video of section one, entitled The Impact of Thyroid Hormones Throughout the Body. In this video, we make the point that T4 and T3 act throughout the whole body, not just on the pituitary. The material in this series is meant to be easily understood. Parts, however, may be somewhat dense and you may wish to review particular sections. If you have suggestions on how to improve this series, we welcome your comments. You may find us on the web at www.plasticeyesurgery.com, email us at info at pesahouston.com, write to us at Plastic Eye Surgery Associates, 3730 Kirby Drive, Suite 900, Houston, Texas, 77098, or telephone us at 713-795-0705. Many believe that T4 acts as a storage and transport hormone only, providing support for T3. This is a profound oversimplification of T4's role. We'll discuss more about this in video four of this section. For now, however, we will consider the combined effect of these two hormones, T4 and T3. The thyroid hormones, T3 and T4, have effects throughout the whole body. The thyroid hormones impact how hot or cold we feel, the rate of food storage and breakdown, weight gain and weight loss, emotions of anxiety and depression, state of mental prowess and arousal, and overall energy. To understand the wide-reaching effects of these hormones, let's consider signs and symptoms of hyper, too much thyroid, and hypo, too little thyroid hormone. By hyperthyroid, we typically mean too much T4, T3, or both T4 and T3. Whereas by hypothyroid, we mean too little T4, T3, or both T4 and T3. Going back to the furnace analogy, the level of thyroid hormone is related to a person's internal temperature regulation. A hyperthyroid person tends to always feel hot, wanting to turn the air conditioning up and fans on, whereas a hypothyroid person tends to feel cold, wanting to wear a sweater when others are totally comfortable. Thyroid status affects overall energy. The hyperthyroid person may be tremulous, bouncy, hyperactive, but subsequently exhausted, energy depleted and fatigued, whereas the hypothyroid person may be obviously low energy, slow, sluggish, and fatigued. The level of thyroid hormone seems to impact mental and psychological states as well. People with too much thyroid hormone may be prone to anxiety, agitation, irritability, hypernervousness, and even panic attacks, whereas people with too little thyroid hormone may be prone to depression and or memory loss. The heart appears to be both directly and indirectly impacted by thyroid levels. A person who is hyperthyroid may have a racing pulse and even feel their heart pounding or irregular heartbeats, so-called palpitations, whereas a person who is hypothyroid may have an unusually slow resting heart rate. Sleeping difficulties are not unusual with thyroid troubles. Someone who is hyperthyroid may have insomnia, difficulty falling or staying asleep, whereas a hypothyroid person is associated with drowsiness and prolonged sleeping. Similarly, someone who has high thyroid hormone levels may be hyperactive and irritable, whereas low thyroid may lead to placid lethargy. The overall metabolic state of the body appears to be regulated in part by thyroid hormone. Hyperthyroidism may lead to increased metabolism, diminished fat reserve, and excessive weight loss with an inability to keep weight on, while hypothyroidism may decrease metabolism, increase energy storage and fat, and cause rapid weight gain. Both high and low thyroid may cause hair loss, either in large clumps or with thinning brittle breakage. Neuromuscular function can be affected with thyroid hormone abnormalities as well. Hyperthyroidism may present with muscle fasciculations or tremors, whereas hypothyroidism may cause muscle cramps or stiffness. Gastrointestinal function and motility can be altered by thyroid hormone irregularities. 
in part due to alterations in water retention, gut absorption of various solutes, and actual gut muscle function, leading to a tendency for diarrhea in hyperthyroid conditions and constipation if the thyroid hormone levels are too low. Even the skin, the largest single organ in the body, can be affected with hyperthyroidism associated with sweaty, oily skin and hypothyroidism associated with dry, scaly skin. Clearly, thyroid hormones have an effect throughout the entire body, 